You're listen, man. If you don't want to see this trash camera quality anymore, this trash lighting, then just donate to my Patreon, bro. It's that simple. All donations to my Patreon will be used for video upgrade purposes. You feel me? So if you do donate, just let me know on Discord and I'll add you on Roblox. Esh, get it. All right, I woke up later than I did yesterday. Jesus Christ, so much going on right now. Oh, but um, we're gonna make this video today. So we're playing Heroes Online for the first time just because I was gonna record solo progression, but it's like, it's too late for that now. I woke up, well, now it's 12 a.m. I have school in six hours, so let's just make this quick little Heroes Online video. I might as well start out this game. So right now we're choosing between a villain and hero. Is there sound? I don't even know. Let's go ahead and choose hero though. So you want to be a hero, huh? Yes, of course. I love all my robot is my hero. Go beyond. Plus ultra. Hey, that's my boy though. For real, for real. All my shout out to you. You feel me? Okay. Hold up. Is there game sound? Okay. This. <laughs> hold up. This might be copyrighted music. I'm just saying. Okay. So we're gonna go to codes, and see if any of these codes work. Night fame. Do I just put an exclamation mark? Uh, I think that code expired. So let me see if the recent code works. It's supposed to be called Gear Gear No Me. Let's see if this works. I don't even know if return. Do I just press enter? Oh, there we go. Okay, so that's the first code Gear Gear No Me. Uh, let's see what else is there. Use code 20k for one epic spin. Okay, let's see if this works. Oh, there we go. We got an epic spin. Okay, let me find out. And then the next code is Night Fame. Let's go ahead and copy and paste this. There we go. All the codes will be in the description, by the way. So, let's see here. There's another code right here. Commoner. A lot of codes. <laughs> yeah, there are a lot of codes out here, boys. Jesus Christ. So, if you're late on this game like me, just go ahead and copy and paste all these codes in the description right now, my guy. Oh, yeah. We cooking up with these codes, boy. Use code release for 10 common spin. All right, bet. I got you, my guy. Release. Okay. Let me find out. We already on a good start for this game. All right. Let's see what we can do to cook up in this game. So, hair. Okay. Let me find out. Let me rock the Frodo. Oh, my. Yo. Is this dude trying to clown my hairline? You thought I was about to rock this. Never mind. That hairline is looking cruised. Are these supposed to be like ghoul eyes if you turn them into red? Like if you turn the pupils into red. Hold up. Look. I'm a ghoul now, y'all. I'm a certified ghoul. But nah, we don't want that. Let's see. Actually, we might want that. No. We're supposed to look like a hero, right? So let's just... We just have the normal eyes. Blue eyes like a hero I am. You feel me? The mouth. Uh, okay, yeah. You, you got me messed up. There's just a normal smile. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> that, that, that. That's my hero smile right there. Okay, my skin color. Let's see. Anyways, okay, I think we're done. Okay, our clothing. Um, We would have Deku, but it's like I'd be fanboying too much. So let me just see what kind of clothing we got going on here. Can we wear our own clothing? I'm pretty sure that's actually Game Pass, so... Um, I'll just wear all my, you know, <laughs> why not? We might as well just change our hair color too while we're at it. How do we change hair color? Can we not change hair color? I got to stay black forever? No, advance. Yeah, I don't know how to change hair color, but here we go. So, um, an epic spin, one epic guaranteed. Okay, we might as well do this, right? I mean, yeah. Ooh! Boy, did we just get all for one? Let me find out. Using double cork is unlocked at level 100, but you can wait. For, okay. Um, went into level 100. And, okay. So we're going to complete now. I mean, we got all for one. I mean, we got the whole all my kit already, dog. Like, let me play now. Yeah, I'm going to actually have to pause you there, Nano. Now, I do correct myself later on into the video, but I just want to address right now that I thought that I actually got one for all, which is all my quirk. But instead, I actually got all for one, which is all for one's quirk. So I just need to address that out there before you guys start flaming me in the comment section. You feel? Oh, for real, for real. Okay. Free roam. Um, 
Okay, yeah, we'll teleport to Hosu City, I guess. So I feel like in this game, you should actually start out with like a normal quirk first because the problem with starting out with something legendary like All For One is, uh, don't quote me on this because I might be wrong, but since All For One is a legendary quirk, you would imagine that you'd have to be a high level to even use the first move, right? So we'll see. Um, abilities, level 10 and seven skill points to unlock. Okay, so, okay, I'm liking this game already. See, um, most games, most My Hero games, they have it so that since it's a legendary quirk you would have to be a high level to even use the first move but this game is starting off right i only have to be level 10 for the first move okay let me find out but let's see here awakening settings let me see this real quick cinematic mode we might as well just put this right oh crap what is this enter name trade you can trade with people that's tough okay so let's just go ahead and um see our first ability we can't use our first ability actually uh how do i punch in this game i don't know how to punch let's see just a left click okay so i don't know who to talk to honestly I'm supposed to be talking to all might over here level one through 20 here we go go finish your sparring cancel quest okay young hero train your skills by sparring with ua students up ahead all right let's see what he's talking about defeat ua students okay let me find out hold up let me go in and ah hold up let me just go ahead and beat up this dude real quick okay combo up then nano but let's go ahead and turn up our volume we don't want this music though can we turn off the music um it's peaceful music though so honestly, I don't even think the music is copyrighted. We, we, we just have the Roblox volume on so that you guys can hear the awesome sound effects, okay? We'll still have our cool little music in the background, you feel me? All right. Let's see here. Ow. He is piecing me up, Jesus. Hey, hey. Did we not have this? Okay, hold up. I don't know if this music is copyrighted or not. I'm going to be honest with you now, brother. I'm gonna have to ping main or something later on. I'm sorry, but uh, we gotta be safe for the one time. We gotta be safe for the one time. And did we even activate this quest? Where's the quest at? It's not here anymore. We bobbing and weaving though. Oh, y'all yeah. completed the first quest. Yo, what's good with you, my guy? What is this? Dude out here spitting lava, dog. God damn. Holy, but let's just go ahead and um. I guess we just keep doing this quest, right? Is it repeatable? Defeat eight UA students, rare spin. Okay. Um, I don't even know what I just did there. I don't think I activated a quest for that, but I think there's like, I guess secret quest in this game that gives me stuff. So that's pretty cool. Okay, I'm messing with this game. This game is, uh, I like it. It's, it's well developed. Um, I didn't play during paid access because I didn't know if it was worth it or not. Even though it was only like 25 Robux, I asked main and he was just like, the game gets fun, but it gets stale once you're max and all that crap. So, I didn't want to buy it. Maybe I should have bought it during beta, dude. <laughs> I'm out here the only noob in our little YouTuber chat right now playing this game. I mean, just look at me. I'm, a, I'm just a smiling hero that's level 7, but it's all good. We'll just have old buddy over here. Thank you, buddy. You're helping me, right? Hit the UA student. It's not hard. Thank you very much. Okay. Let's just, <laughs> you know, have old buddy over here leech for me. Thank you. You'll be my uh, leecher for XP, my guy. All right, we're level 10 now. Let's see what we can do. Um, so, abilities. Skill point 7. Equip. E. Okay. Air cannon blast. Let's see what this does. E. Okay. Let me find out. Let me see how much I can spam this for, though. I don't know the cooldown on it. I guess moves in this game have a certain cooldown. It doesn't take, like, any mana or anything like that. Or stamina. Whatever. Okay. So, yeah. I, I can see. This game might be balanced in PvP somewhat. I don't really know yet. But that's a cool system. There's, like, no mana, no stamina system, none of that. I also find out that later on, the only reason why my stamina wasn't showing was because I had cinematic mode on. And it hid, like, all the GUI. So, don't even flame me on that one. And my bad if the camera was shaking. I just have an addiction to um, shaking my whole leg. So it shakes the whole room. But let's see here. Skill points. So 
You can use skill points to upgrade your stuff, but you can also use it to buy moves. So I got to be careful about what I want. So we have an awakening at level 55. And what is this? We have an uppercut move. Skill points required 15. We might as well buy it, right? Equip it to our R. There we go. Okay, so we have strength, court control, stamina, and health. So we do have stamina and court control, but I wonder what's the difference. I Yeah, I don't know the difference. Maybe stamina increases speed and court control reduces the cooldowns on your moves. I really don't know, but for now, I think the wisest one is just to put everything in strength so that we can actually just one-shot these NPCs while we do like the... All right, let's see these moves now. Now that I have like... 15 strength to my name okay i feel like <laughs> i did nothing i mean i guess i am a little stronger i only did like 10 a hit now i'm doing like 12 you feel me so let's go ahead and try to use this uppercut though hey okay so i see <laughs> i see that did not work at all i did not work to how i planned on hold up uppercut hey okay let me find out the uppercut literally does more damage than my first um my first, what you might call it, my first move for the all for one cork. Okay, boom. You already know how it is. I think that multi hit stuff. Ah, it's on cooldown. Come on, get it off cooldown. There we go. Yep, it is AOE, so that's pretty cool. Very nice move to have. What is this called again? It's like, uh, air cannon blast. Our next move will be at level 23, though. Okay, let me find out. And I gotta make sure, is this, this is one for all, right? No, this is all for one. Have I been saying the wrong thing this whole time? Oh my god, okay, so for the people that have came this far into the video and haven't roasted me in the comment section yet, I have all for one, okay? I don't have one for all, so oh my god, I can see all the comments roasting me right now because I think earlier in the video, I was like, oh yeah, I'm the next All Might now. My bad about that one, y'all. I have uh, all for one, not one for all, okay? Oh my god. Hopefully you guys made it this far into the video so uh, nobody tries to flame me in the comment section. I'll probably pause the video while I'm editing anyways and explain to you the whole process. I'm like, okay guys, don't roast me. I thought I got one for all. Or not one for all. Yeah, I thought I got one for all, but I ended up getting one all for one. So, um, we're just going to keep doing this until we're level 15 and then participate in whatever event this is. So you can actually change your role to a villain or hero. Which, I don't really know why you would want to. I don't know. Maybe it's because only villains can attack, like, heroes. And heroes can attack villains. So, if you're on the same alignment in the world, you can't really attack people. So, I think that's why you can change rules. But, let's just go ahead and press play now. And see what kind of events they're talking about. Um, There's no events. Okay, so there's team battles at level 30. But, I don't know about events. I think it's in the normal city. We'll just have to find out where it is. Reach level 10. So these are like the little mini quests that you can uh, get. So there's these little milestones. If you do all this, you can actually get some uh, rewards on the way. So it looks like use three quirk moves. Um, so we're going to have to unlock three quirk moves, I guess. And then we can actually get spins and stuff for it. Okay, that's cool. They have like these little mini quests. Okay. Defeat eight UA students. We got the little spins from it. Now we have to defeat these guards or whatever they're called. Okay. So this that's pretty cool. They have like little mini quests along the way. Um, it's not bad. And then there's an encyclopedia. Oh, yeah, this game is looking mad fun right now, y'all. I just got to find out where the events are. So maybe it's over here in the yellow, maybe? Probably, right? So we're just going to go there for the one time real quick. And yeah, now we can see the little stamina bar and everything. So we can see, hold up. If we press E, does it take stamina? Okay, that doesn't take stamina. So your moves actually don't take stamina. I guess your stamina just determines how long you can dash for then. All right, that's cool. Let's see. Erase your head. These hooligans. Uh, yeah, okay, whatever. Okay, this is definitely not. Yeah, this is just another quest. So we'll just defeat the hooligans. Why not, right? All right, there we go. We finally got it. And honestly, bro, I'm so garbage. I'm actually so garbage at hitting the little uppercut. But oh, yo, yo, is that a boss? Hero killer stain. Oh, no. 
All right, I think I'm just gonna end the episode here and this guy changed his hair color I need to see where that's at but yeah, I'm liking this game so far y'all uh, I like the variety in this game to where like th there's so many ways you can get your spins, right? It's this game is definitely not pay to win quit Ooh, boy. Yeah, we a certified hero now, but like I was saying there's so many things you can do in this game to like acquire quirks and whatnot, so it's not heavily based off of like code or anything like that. You can actually, you know, legit actually earn spins for quirks in this game, which I like, dog. Um, this game is definitely not pay to win at all. It seems fun. I just got to know what to do later on. So we're just going to end the video here. Definitely made my day by playing this game. I woke up, bro, thinking of a video to make. I didn't expect much from this game, but this game really uh, changed the mood up for today, even though I do have school in six hours anyways i mean i'll sleep well i guess knowing that i played this game so i hope you guys enjoyed if you did be sure to like comment subscribe and remember get you a beautiful asian woman